our joyful home. Today we're going to introduce you to our, the newest member of our family, Little Liberty Rose. So she is <laughs> one week and two days old, or no, let's see here, yeah, one week and two days. It's taken me a while to film this. Um, we've just been really soaking in the newborn stage and postpartum and just I'm feeling really good um, but yeah it's been a while and I'm finally getting down to filming this and introducing you guys to our little daughter so we had a girl or we have a girl and um, it was awesome I had a feeling throughout this pregnancy and it was really hard to have a definitive guess but I always had this feeling that it was going to be a girl and sure enough God gave us a little girl another little girl to love so um, we have had a boy first then we had a daughter then we had another boy and then now we have another girl so it's been boy girl boy girl um, which is kind of funny but yeah our fourth baby is a girl. Her name is Liberty Rose Van Kirk. She was born September 2nd, 2024 at 8.37 a.m. So she is, she was seven pounds, two ounces, and 19 and a half inches long. Her labor was eight, eight-ish hours. Um, I haven't actually figured out the exact hours, but around eight hours long. And so more info on the birth to come. There will be a video coming out soon on her birth story and all that went on and all that and how she came into be on how to how she came to be in her arms and everything. Um, she's a baby who loves to sleep and eats great, has really very little issues. I'm letting her suck on my finger right now because she decided that she wants to nurse again. She is a very hungry little girl and loves to eat. Um, so <laughs> I'm trying to just pacify her for a bit. Um, but yeah, so our fourth is a girl. Her name is Liberty Rose. Things are going great. She's a week and two days old. Crazy. Um, her name we have wanted since our third child because with our third we also did not know the gender. So we had two names picked out, Jonathan and Liberty Rose, or Jonathan Clark, or the middle name wasn't picked out till birth, but um, we had a, a name picked out for a boy and a name picked out for a girl, and the name that we picked out for a girl would uh, would have been Liberty Rose. And so we had a boy with, him, with our third, and so we still loved that name, and so we had decided if this was a girl to name her Liberty Rose. So sure enough, we were able to um, yeah, keep that name and name her Liberty Rose. Um, so we've always loved um, the name Rose. I've always loved the name Rose. I thought it was always such a very feminine and beautiful name. And Josiah has always loved the name Lib or he has liked most in most recent years and since we've been having kids, has loved the name Liberty. And Liberty definitely, um, especially in our country right now, um, where freedom and liberty are something that we should all be cherishing, something we all should be remembering that our forefathers died, fought and died for. And um, so that her name definitely has a special, a special place in our hearts. Um, but we also just really liked the name Liberty. It was very old fashioned, very patriotic. We're a very old fashioned and patriotic family. And so we just thought that her name, Liberty Rose, fit just perfectly and definitely fit our family perfectly. So that's kind of the story behind her name. Um, but yeah, we love her. She's great. She's growing so awesome. And I cannot believe she's almost 10 days old. Um, but yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this little update and an introduction to our newest little girl, our newest baby. And I look forward to bringing you guys more content 
um, especially postpartum and the birth story coming up very soon. So stay tuned for those and I will see you guys in our next video. Have a great one. Bye.